Hey everybody, what's going on? Your host AMF1534 here. Welcome back to Let's Play. God, that guy got shot right in the face. I did not do that last time. That is a lie. That is not something that happened. But maybe it did. I don't know. This also did not happen, that I remember at least. That I can remember at least. But welcome back to Let's Play some more Max Payne 3. In the last episode, we broke out of this crazy-ass prison full of people that were just raring to kill us. And then we took it to the streets, and that's when it got really ugly, aside every part of it being ugly. But we got to blow up a tank, that was cool. Or some other type of, you know, mobilize. Yeah, this thing, it was like an armored truck. I guess it wasn't really a tank. I don't think there's really people just driving tanks around town. But now, we are in this building here, having dealt with that whole mess of problems. We get to go into the Estacionamento. The uh, Saida, whatever the hell that is, I don't know what exactly what that translates to. So let's see what we can... Oh, you guys are gonna die. This is what you get for keeping your back turned to me. Even though that guy was ready for it. That guy, however, was not. Hey! Oh, ouch. Okay, if I was that guy, I would not get up so quickly. Like, you just got shot in the head. Dark, rainy night. Another police station. Another futile crusade for amends. Time moves forward. Nothing changes. You are 100% right, Max. <laughs> I mean, exactly when have any of the crusades that you've been on going through these types of places, whether it be police stations or otherwise, when have they really paid off for you outside of keeping you from being killed? Oh, oh, no. Oh, okay, I guess we're in for it now. <laughs> We're in for the ride at this point. Alright, which door is it? This one? Nope. Big doors. Our, oh, checkpoint. <laughs> Do -do -do. Checkpoint! Oh, yeah, good old... Oh, hey, okay, maybe I shouldn't be stupid like that, trying to read what's on the wall. Hey, guess what? I see you. Peekaboo, you're dead! And you are also dead because you're being stupid and you're not looking. What was he doing? Why was he just standing there? Like this guy is also doing, and he's gonna die as well. Why are all these guys just standing here like that? These guys are stupid. <laughs> okay, at least this guy had an ounce of smarts in him. At least he didn't just stand there and take it like the other guys. All those guys literally just... I don't know. They just stood there. Like, they all saw me. What did they think was gonna change? Well, maybe he can't see me. I hope not. Every bastard in the joint must have known I was on the loose by now. I couldn't afford to waste any more time. I don't think we've really been wasting time at all during this whole thing, to be honest with you. I think that we've been doing exactly at the right pace what we were supposed to be doing. All right. So with these golden guns, I mean, I, I don't. I've only completed like getting one full one of these. But when you do get a full one, like, is it just like an enhancement? Is it just like increasing damage or like, I don't know, like re like decreasing reloading time? Or what exactly is the benefit of that? Are they like actual like new guns that you unlock? Because that would be awesome. Hey, painkillers. <laughs> In the girls' bathroom nonetheless, why wouldn't there be? For their weird periods and excess blood. Where's the, where's the red light? Oh, there it is. It's like, why are, where is this coming from? Just making sure there's nothing in any of these stalls. I was thinking maybe there'd, there'd be like some painkillers in there, but I was mistaken. <laughs> I'm sorry, sir, but I'm afraid you're mistaken. You see, we're looking for a young man. Oh, no. What the hell? Hey, I'm cool with these guys not knowing that I'm here. That's, that's fine. <laughs> well, that's just all right. So my question is, like, what exactly is it that we oh boy what are we trying to do right now like who are we really trying to get to like are we just trying to get to the head of this police station like the guy that's in charge of all this or like what's what's the central goal at the moment i i kind of forgot exactly what it is that we're doing i remember there was there was there was a reason for us coming here i mean there was a guy that police i think we were supposed to negotiate the with the world over but I could reminisce about the old days later. For now, there was more pressing matters to deal with. Hmm. 
I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of at a loss on that one. It shows that my brain is not all here today because I really cannot for the life of me remember what it was that we were in this place for. I would assume it was a guy that we were negotiating with, but obviously when we came in here, that didn't really work out very well. Oh, tight. It's the little cafeteria. I kept thinking that all these salt and pepper shakers were painkillers. I was like, dude, these guys are popping these things like, uh, like, like aspirins. I mean, they were taking aspirin like aspirin. That didn't make any sense. I'm sorry. <laughs> I just got off of work, so I, my, I'm not all here today. My, my brain is just gone. Okay, well, this guy's going to be easy enough to kill. Why don't you just give me another direct shot at you? I swear, man, like, these guys, for being for being on a police force or, you know, any type of armed force, you don't just go running gung-ho at the guy knowing exactly where he is. It's doesn't make it a good idea to just go, Hey, I've got a bulletproof vest on. Let's just go... Run right on in there after him. Why not? Sounds like a great idea. What the hell is this guy doing? Oh, you know, yeah, that's a smart move. I could I, My shoe's untied. I keep stepping on it. You better let me pick up those painkillers, Max. Don't you dare cut to a different scene that won't let me do that. It looked like the prisoners were giving them a run for their money. That's what happens when you hand some roided-up halfwit a commando uniform with special on the front and let him ride around his hometown in a tank playing soldiers. Sooner or later, someone's gonna decide he's not so special. There were a bunch more in the elevator, tooled up like they were about to roll into Fallujah. And of course, they were headed my way. Oh, of course they were. Why wouldn't they be? Better yet, how'd they know that I was in here? <laughs> That's kind of weird, that they just knew that. I don't believe these guys had intuition to know that. I just don't. I don't buy that for a moment. They're cheating. They used the Game Shark in this situation. That's not very nice. It's okay. They can use all the Game Sharks they want because I am a better assassin than they are. Because like he, like he said, I'm not just a Roy... Uh-oh. We are in big trouble now. <laughs> Here I go, off talking a bunch of shit. I'm going to get myself killed. Because I got shot in the face. Great. What I get. Way to go, Adam. Way to say that you're a better assassin than them when you're outnumbered. It's okay. We're gonna do it now. We're not gonna get. Okay, that is not what I need. I don't need you to bust out the window. Oh my god. Well, once again, that proved to be a bad. I ah, yeah. Look at that. I got him. I really did. Actually, worked out okay. Problem though is that we need to get back up and get back down, down, down. Jeez, what the hell's going on? Okay, I can be down with this situation at the moment. Just because there's a couple of these guys I can kill immediately. Maybe not. It's a time I really, really wish that I had some grenades on hand. But I don't. Oh, wow. Hey, you're shining that in my eye. Stop being a douche about it. Okay, did I kill... Oh, ho, ho. Oh, I thought I got it. I thought I, thought, I thought I got down quickly enough to get away from that, but I certainly didn't. And now we have found my new Achilles heel. This entire thing. Oh, come on. How are these guys so good? These guys really are a little bit better than a, a little bit more than I gave them credit for initially. Okay, you really need to not do that. Okay, down. There we go. Get the old pills in ya. Okay. Oh no! You're here and you're gonna die because I said so. And we are dead. <sighs> I'm taking way too much pleasure in killing these guys because I'm like sitting here wasting bullets on them. It's a very poor idea, realistically. Okay, go, go, go. Up, up. There we go. One man down. Hand down, man down. The one... The one small benefit of getting ourselves into a pickle like this is that every time we die from this point forward, it seems like they're giving us another painkiller to use. Holy crap. Can't even get a damn shot off anymore without getting one right square in the face. Okay. I see ya. I see ya. I know what's going on. There we go. Man down! Where are you? There you are. Aha! You're dead, you dick. 
Okay, so that's another... Oh, no. That's a guy I don't have to deal with. Go down! Whew! Still isn't a very ideal situation to be in, though. There we go. Okay. Oh, d come on. I mean, I would like to think that the types of bullets I'm using right now would have enough force in them that if I shot him in the neck, that it would kill him. Apparently, I am... Apparently, I don't know the science behind weaponry. Oh, down. He's not alive. There's no way. I mean, actually, there's plenty of way, but... When there's a will, there's a way. No. Stay down. Oh my gosh. Yeah, look at that! Max's time in the fake, not real army actually paid off. Just pop your gun out there and shoot away. It works. Why haven't I been doing this the whole time? This is such an awesome idea. It's actually working. How ingenious of an idea is that? Because I don't actually have to, like, come up for this. I can just put my gun out there and shoot. The better part is that it actually works. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, 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 what are you doing? Oh, okay, that's fine. Oh, my God, I didn't realize that we were almost dead. Yes! We made it through! Just barely. Oh, my God. If the heat was rising, that meant I was getting closer to the source. Uh, yeah. Moving. I can feel the coils of the heat burning in my face right now with how much we just had to deal with here. My god. Okay, I'm actually really down with getting this weapon. Mainly because everybody's been using them. So, I think that would be a great way to uh, kind of switch gears here and get some better weaponry with more ammo in it. I saw the elevator doors were open. Yeah, well, that's great, but we need to get some health. Thank God we had one of those right around here. Hey, we got the, the, the commando. Sick. Awesome. Coolio. Alright, let's go jump right on in there. Uh-oh. Dude, come on. Is this going to be another one of those... Oh, by the way, the elevator's broken, so you have to climb up the hard way. ...in the local elevator. Of course not. This is like Max Payne 2 all over again. It even kind of reminds me of the same place a little bit, even though it was in a hospital and not here. Hey, who the hell are you? Where did you come from in this whole mix of things? You were not there a moment ago. Gotcha. Awesome. Okay, let's move on. I should probably be kind of careful about what I'm doing here. Obviously, these guys are just here with guns. Kids with guns. Kids with guns. Oh, yeah. Well, these guys playing poker? Strip poker. That's what's been going on. I see. I mean, this guy... What, do you got a queen, a ten, and a seven? If you're playing blackjack, that hand sucks. Okay, so what's going on out there? Obviously, nothing that we need to get our hands on. Nothing in there either. All right, let's go this way. Well, there's nothing here. Whatever depressing fate oh, lay on the oh no! Doors, there was no point in putting it off any longer. Okay, that wasn't a smart idea at all. And there's nowhere for me to really hide. I mean, if I go through that door, I have to go through the door. Oh, we got this though. Okay, never mind. I don't even care. Let's just be smart about this in any way that we can. Oh my God, that was a terrible idea. Oh! No! Shoot the guy! What are you doing, man? Why is that not hitting anybody? Oh, well, that was dumb. The guy was right in front of me. How did none of those bullets hit him? Were they all hitting the door? Because it didn't look like it. Well, what the hell? I'm not happy about that scenario at all. However, we run out of time for now. So, my friends, when we come back on the next installment of Let's Play Max Payne 3, we get to kind of trudge around here on the old second floor, or what I believe to be the second floor. So, since we're going up to the fifth floor, as we found out, we got a long ways to go. So, I can only imagine what is in store for us now. So, until then, my friends, this is your host, AMF1534, saying thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.